This is the adjustable gap cell for discs for the Surpass 3 electrokinetic analyzer. It's a measuring cell for flexible or rigid planar samples that are available as discs with a certain diameter. Currently, sample holders are available that accommodate discs with diameters of either 14 mm or 15 mm. Applications cover sensor discs or substrates for incubation tests, for example. This video shows you how to mount your sample in the adjustable gap cell for discs and how to mount the cell in Surpass 3. We are going to mount a polymer foil. First, you need to disassemble the cell. Remove the two screws to open the measuring cell. Secure the spacer gasket. Now remove the sample holders of both parts of the cell. Use the Torx T20 screwdriver to push the sample holder out of the lower part of the cell. To remove the sample holder of the upper part of the cell, loosen the screw at the adjustment knob and use this screw to push out the sample holder. Now use the punching tool to mount the sample onto the sample holders. Prepare the sample holder and the puncher and place them in the frame. The sample holder has to stick out of the puncher by about one millimeter. Use the metal bar to align the position of the sample holder. Cut out a suitably sized piece of adhesive tape and place it on the backside of the polymer foil. Peel off the protective cover and stick the tape onto the sample holder. Place the puncher with the sample holder and sample in the punching tool. Tighten the knob of the punching tool completely. Remove the puncher with the sample holder and the excess adhesive tape and sample. Use the metal bar to push the sample holder out of the puncher. Proceed in the same way with the second sample holder.
insert the small sample holder in the lower part of the cell. Use the support plate to push the sample holder into the recess while you lower its position with a screwdriver. Place the lower half of the cell on the pedestal. Insert the spacer gasket into the recess of the cell. Place the larger sample holder in the upper part of the cell. Use the support plate to push the sample holder in. Turn the lock at the adjustment knob until the sample holder snaps into place. Fix the holder with a screw. Level the position of the sample surface with the adjustment knob. Use the straight edge for fine adjustment. Close the measuring cell and tighten both halves with the screws. Now you can mount the measuring cell on the instrument. Simply plug in the cell and lock it by turning the lever to an upright position. The adjustable gap cell for discs is then recognized by the Surpass 3 software. Use the rinse cycle to adjust the gap between the sample surfaces while filling the cell with measuring liquid.